it's Around Town with Mandy, and I'm here today at the Queen Anne's County 4-H Park, and I've got a good news story for you. I'm here with Melissa Quillen. How are you today? I'm great, thanks. Good. So I'm here with the Go-Getters 4-H Club. Yep. Tell me the three leaders we have this evening. So I'm Melissa Quillen. We have Denise Smith and Heather Garner on their ends. And you guys are with the Go-Getters 4-H Club. Go-Getters 4-H Club. We are one of the largest clubs. We have about 42 members. Nice. So one of the things that we can see new this year at the fair are these benches. Yep. So tell us a little bit about these benches and what they're made out of. So we started a recycling project in 2018 here at the park. We uh, recycled all around the park and then we had a great idea that we would recycle um, plastic bottle caps and bags and we took them to Echo Plastics in Wilmington, Delaware and they made these fabulous benches out of all the recycling that we collected. Nice. And you guys are still collecting? We are still collecting. So if someone's interested in donating plastic, where or where can they take it? Who can they get a hold of? Um, they can reach out to any of the go-getters. We have plenty here. Um, I take it all the time at our farm. We are on um, Stony Knoll Farms in Crumpton, Maryland. Just drop it off at the office at the end of my lane. Nice. So this evening, we're going to do a little presentation, and you are the club is going to present these to the park board so they'll be at the fair. Yeah. So on behalf of the Go-Getters and our four-year recycling project, we'd like to donate these plastic benches to the park board um, for everybody to use throughout the year. And we, um, we're continuing to recycle, so we hope to have more to spread out throughout the park. Thank you. Thank you. We, we love having benches that don't rot. <laughs> so, well, they're are, not going to really rot. Nice. Yeah, they're not going to really rot. Like to have them um, we have different, they can do different colors. We like the green for 4-H. Um, but if you guys choose, we can do brown, we can do black, we can do red. Okay. But you tell us. How do you guys recycle to get them? Um, we just collected, you weren't over here a minute ago, we just collected <laughs> from the community. Um, I have a horse trailer sitting on the farm. We stack it as tight as we can get it. And Zachary and I, who is our president of our club, who could not be with us tonight, um, drove to downtown Wilmington with a horse trailer. Real fun. Um, <laughs> they unload it and pay us by the pound. And then we swap it out for the benches. They make nice. picnic tables um, and then any kind of plank boards pretty much everything. It's a really neat, neat um, company. Okay. Thank you all. Thank you all for doing this. Uh, from the fair and the, you want me to hold this thing? <laughs> Brian, you got to talk too. From the fair and the park board, um, we really appreciate these benches. They look great. Uh, we look forward to getting more in the, in the future if you choose to do so. Um, like I said, we love, love them because they don't rot. That way to keep us from having to build new park benches all the time. And uh, we thank you guys very much. Okay. All right, we're going to pass this back to Mandy. <laughs> so that concludes our good news story. But on the last note, what do you got to say, kids? See you next week.